Hey everybody, Tall Family Films here. Today I'm cleaning the wheels on a Dyson DC50. Not the big roller in the middle, but these actual little wheels that got clogged up with hair and lint. I looked all over, I couldn't find a simple way to do this. Um, so I came up with a simple way and I want to share it with you here. It's a pretty easy trick. First I tried the logical approach with needle nose pliers. That failed. So then I thought, what if I melted it? The needle nose pliers just couldn't pull up enough of it at one time because it's all so tight around the wheels. So I thought, well, what if I melt it all into one big wad, right? So here's what happened when I did that. I'm holding it on there for about three seconds. I don't wanna melt the wheel, don't wanna melt the plastic. I don't want you to do that either. I'm just holding it there for just a couple seconds to make it all kind of tighten up together. So now my needle nose pliers are a lot more effective at pulling out big chunks of this. So uh, the idea here is you melt it, you pull out what you've melted, then you melt it again and pull out what you've melted the second time. So right now we're having pretty good success at pulling out big chunks of it. Once I get it all frayed again after pulling on it, we go and we melt it again. Exact same process. It's very easy. I just couldn't find anything anywhere that showed a simpler way to do this. So this was my method. It seemed to work pretty well for me. Hopefully it'll work well for you as well. So then I went and got some air, compressed air, and a can here, just to kind of finish up the job, clean up what's left. So the wheel is turning a lot easier now than it did in the beginning. So it's not perfect. I can't get in there and grease the wheel very easily. But if this video helped you, you can really help me by subscribing to my channel and giving this video a thumbs up. Thank you very much.